This coding question contains the only math you need for interviews. So we're giving an integer return true if the number is a palindrome. Now let's go over what is a palindrome. So a number is a palindrome if we can read its digits the same way forwards and backwards. Let's go over the doll process. We can create the reverse form of the number. The number is a palindrome if it's equal to its reverse form. To generate the reverse form, we will process the digits from right to left. We are able to get the current rightmost digit using the modulus operator. And this is because any number modulus by 10, we're able to get the value at the ones place. After retrieving the rightmost digit, we can remove it using the division operator. And this is because any number divided by 10, we're able to remove the digit at the ones place. Let's say four is our rightmost digit and we want to add it to our 23. We will need to multiply 23 by 10 and then increment it by four to generate the new number. Let's implement the function as palindrome taking x. If x is negative, return false, create the reverse and the copy of x. While copy is greater than zero, retrieve the rightmost digit, append the rightmost digit, remove the rightmost digit, and then we can return true if reverse is equal to x.